championship's better anyway. Come on, Blades. Yeah, so it's a difficult one tonight. I'm struggling to have the same anger um, that I see other people sort of having on social media. Um, I can't find myself being angry with players that just aren't good enough to compete in the best league in the world, to be honest. Um, especially with the journey that's been on with us. Uh, I don't want to harp on about the past too much, but, um, but yeah, they've come a long way with us. And even though it has been obviously an embarrassing season for the club, I just can't find myself at the minute to be angry about it. Um, certainly after tonight's performance, where any other time we'd probably be happy with that. Um, it's not often that we've been the better team this season. I think we were tonight. Um, yeah, it's just a bit, a bit of perspective, really, that we just want to be back in the grounds and get back to the championship, rebuild a bit, get back in the grounds, uh, just enjoy being a blade again. It's not a glory club, we know that. It's hard work. There's peaks and troughs. More troughs than there are peaks. Yeah, just have to go again, don't we, Blades? On to next week. Well, Blades fans, the Premier League journey is over and it has been some journey and I'm sure we'll all have time to reflect and look back on what has been a crazy couple of years at the club, particularly this year. You know, it's, it's not been the greatest, but, you know, it, it is what it is, I suppose. And you look at last year and, and some of the memories we made as fans going to games and, and you know, and the lads really did as proud and, and Chris Wilder and, and all the club, to be honest with you, in this season. It's been a little bit of a mess and, you know, the, the R's next to our name now we're, we're officially down. Doesn't hurt quite as much as as it probably would have said going down on the last day because we've we've had some term you know some time to come to term of it all now. A little bit good, but you know it is what it is, and you know on the plus side there's no VAR next year, and hopefully we get the managerial appointment right, and then we can come again next year and keep keep the vast majority of our good players. You know, I'm not not saying we're going to keep all of them, but keep keep you know the, the likes of Aaron Egan and O'Connell. I think we'll probably lose Sanderberg to be honest, but that's a, that's a, a discussion for a different day. Today's match, I thought we were absolutely outstanding. I thought the better team lost. Um, some really great football at the time. I said after one minute, you know, we'll look more up for this than we have done in previous weeks. Move the ball around so much quicker. And, you know, I know Bulls had their possession as well, like they're always going to do. They're a really good side. And we were very, very unlucky. I think Brewster put a great cross in and then it comes to Stevens, was it, for the save? And then, what was it, 10 seconds later, it's in the back of our net. Sort of just sums that season up a little bit, really. You know, we should score one minute and then 10 seconds later it's in the net at the other end. But yeah, I, I'm proud to be honest, I'm proud to be a Blade. I know it's probably a bit daft saying that after the season we've had and the moans and the rants we've all had. But you know, it's definitely time to uh, look back on, on the great memories we've had over the last couple of years, get to the end of the season and, and try and, and make new memories with, with the new manager that comes in. Hello, we said we'd be back with another uh, reaction to defeat and here we are. Well, we don't, we don't let you down, but you said we'd lose by more more than a couple of goals, so you you, you shortchanged us. Yeah, true. And and in fairness, we didn't probably didn't deserve to lose tonight. Uh, much better performance. Um, those so-called fine margins that the commentators bang on about that are never fine margins because we've been crap this season. It actually was tonight, and we, yeah, I don't think anyone could have complained if it was a draw or probably more likely us to win. Yeah, we did we did okay tonight. We were kind of organised. We had a structure. Um, I don't think we ever really looked like scoring. Mainly that was because Stevens just pathetic finishing. But um, well, they did have a good effort um, after after they uh, they scored. But um, yeah, we were in the game and and we actually went forward and had some attacks, which we've, we've not done for, for much of this season. And and it weren't like they were having chance after chance when they attacked. Um, so it, it was an unfortunate defeat. Yeah, for once, for once. Uh, but yeah, it's just. <sighs> At least, I mean, it's official now. We're relegated. At least we've confirmed something. We've achieved something this season. Um, we're down. Yeah, so, oh, sorry. I should have broke down, that to you. you say? I should, yeah. <laughs> I, should have, I, should, I should have broke it a bit more gently than that, shouldn't I? Sorry. Sorry. It's like Mark Steen moment at Chelsea all over again for you, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, it's... Uh, I, yeah, it's it, it, a bit of relief in some ways, I would say. Is it? It's, we've been down for ages. I suppose it's it's good to find no, but to that. have it confirmed and, and oh, like wow. now you can, yeah, yeah. <laughs> pretty you can relax. Arthur, relax. But no, I mean, I mean, 
he, he played some different players. He played Brewster, he took Lundstrom out. You know, Osborne did okay. Brewster, you know, there were some bits and pieces from him. Should have been there. Should have had a player sent off uh, for a challenge against him. And he, he was all right tonight. But as I say, it was still, still, we never really looked like scoring. And um, you know, whenever we get forward, you just no one's really got an idea, have they? No. I mean, they should take a, a note from my uh, Cobra Kai T-shirt. Oh, yeah. Strike first, strike, strike first, hard. Strike hard. I would, I would go for the no mercy bit on the bottom, but we can't even do them first bits. They very rarely strike first. <laughs> they certainly weren't striking hard. That Steven shot, um, <laughs> absolute hero. Strike it just in a general direction and hope for the best. And oh shit, they're on the attack. Oh, they're yeah, I mean, I should probably redo this t-shirt for Burke, shouldn't I? Strike <laughs> towards the goal. In fact, actually, strike forwards. Yeah. Strike sideways, backwards, <laughs> <laughs> anywhere but so. yeah, goalwards. At least we, at least we wore some uh, different shorts. Uh, look, look like uh, flumps, marshmallow flumps tonight, which was uh, nice to see. Yeah, yeah, but didn't perform like a much, much more, much harder performance, <laughs> which obviously brings us on to Soft the oil. injury. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. So his stiff groin didn't turn out to be a problem after all. I don't know if. <clears throat> Some of the staff. There's all those adverts on the telly at the moment. Isn't there? There's what's the <laughs> I don't know the company. But have you seen those adverts? Oh They're yeah, yeah. Shouting them out, aren't they? Like with the different phrases for uh, the male, the male member sort of thing. Which you know, you're having your tea and there's like a man shout out in like different words. It's like I don't need this. Well, just let me have my tea in peace. Fleck didn't need it either. Quite the opposite. <laughs> but he's, he got it down <laughs> and. Um, because, yeah. It looked like a man that was struggling to run properly tonight. It, it didn't have the best of games, did it? But yeah, I've, someone sorted him out anyway this week, and it's nice to see. Yeah. But we'll see if we can actually bother getting a manager in or the chairman or anyone really. Just yeah, just get anyone in. That'll do. <laughs> so it's finally confirmed we have got relegation back to the championship, back to the men's league actually. I'm not going to miss the Premier League that much. It was nice while it lasted. Uh, yeah, uh, play for a bit of pride now towards the end of the season. I thought tonight we were the better team. I thought Wolves were really poor. I think Adama Traore, apart from that counter attack, is probably one of the most overrated players in the Premier League. That's my opinion. I don't think our defence were too bad, apart from the mistake that led up to the goal. I thought Stevens and Brian were our 18 defence played pretty well. Uh, I do feel it is a bit of a, a, a fan victory tonight. No sign of John fucking Lundstrom, which was just pure joy just to watch the game without him pissing me off. So yeah, th that's a victory in itself. So I have towards the end of the season now, just see what we can do. Get a bit of confidence boost, hopefully. Just somehow we'll try and get a win or something. Just give it a bit of boost for next season. Nice to see Bruce start a game keep doing that it'll come good i hope i think so yeah just nice to get out of the way now and look forward to next season let's go so that's it then officially relegated pick up my bets uh not worst performance but uh i thought wolves were crap and all to be honest with you still never looked like scoring we had a couple of chances but for all ball we had, not creating, no are we? School by error again. We had best chance at match run, they squad. Stevens misses, they go up front, and what Brian's doing, I'll never know. Under 10 defending that, just leaving Traore. <laughs> Worst person you could afford to leave. But, uh, got some games left now against bottom half, see what happens. See if we can get, uh, Get one more win, maybe, from the last few games. But, uh, no, well. Can't wait for it to be over. Na, 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 na.